The State Legion AA Tournament rolls on out west in Dickinson. The winners bracket teams with a day off Wednesday back in action Thursday, hoping for at least one win to extend their season to Friday. First game of the day featured the Minot Vistas in the West Fargo Patriots. Top of the third, Minot leading 3-0. Line drive into center. Easton Panasuk slides and makes the play for the out. Move to the fifth, West Fargo trailing 4-2. Caleb Anderson hits one to deep center, and it'll fall, bringing in a run with an RBI double, cutting the deficit to one. Later in the inning, Parker Hahn coming in relief and gets the fly ball out to left to keep the lead for the Vistas. However, this game would go to extra innings, and in the eighth, Caleb Deer smacks a go-ahead RBI double to right center, a four-run rally as West Fargo gets the comeback victory over Minot, winning 8-4. So it's do or die for the Vistas, taking on ninth seed Williston. Minot flexing its muscles early. Kellen Burke blasting a solo home run to left center, giving the Vistas a 1-0 lead in the first. Move to the sixth. Minot down by a run. Line drive into center. Gets by the diving defender, scoring the game-tying run with an RBI single. Bottom of the seventh. Bases loaded for Williston. Two outs. Max Heen lines one down the line. A walk-off RBI single as Williston keeps their season alive, advancing to Friday with a 7-6 victory. Now to the other winner's bracket game. Bismarck Govs and the Fargo Post. Two, bottom of the third, runners on the corners, and a butt down the right side gets a run home for post two, and they lead 2-0. Now in the sixth, Charlie Kalbrenner crushes this no-doubt two-run homer to keep deep right field, extending the lead to 4-0. Later in the inning, two runners on, Bundetep, but Max Vig gets out of his squat, fields, and throws the third to get the lead runner out. This game, however, was Zach Lamont's as he threw a complete game shutout, surrendering five hits only. Fargo Post 2 advancing to Friday's semifinal, 6-0 the score. So the Govs battling the Mandan Chiefs in an elimination game. Top of the first, McCoy Keller lines this one to center. Hudson Sheldon able to score from second, and it's a 1-0 Mandan lead. Home half of the inning, single into left by Gavin Lill. Michael Fogerland going to come in to score, and this game tied up at one. Home half of the second, Fogerland at the plate now, flying one to right, and it's deep enough to score. Jace grows close from third. Bismarck with the 2-1 lead. They would not look back. They end up keeping their season alive at 11-1 victory. So here's where we stand for Friday's slate. West Fargo and Fargo Post 2 will play for a spot in the title game at 1 Central. Wilson faces Bismarck that game at 4. The winner of that one will play the loser of West Fargo and Fargo Post 2 at 7 p.m.